What's up everybody, it's your boy AB from AB underscore XY. Welcome to the channel and welcome to another Combat Master video. And today we're going to be going over some of the most recent developments regarding Combat Master, but most specifically... <gasps> Embarrassing! <laughs> but most specifically regarding all of these Battle Royale leaks. <laughs> Before we start talking about all the most recent leaks and stuff regarding the Battle Royale, I do want to give everybody a quick shout out and thank you guys so much for joining my most recent Combat Master livestream. The other night we streamed Combat Master and a bunch of you guys showed up and it was really nice seeing you guys there in the chat. It was a lot of fun getting to hang out with everybody and play games with everyone. We ran a bunch of custom games, we played every single mode, every league, and a lot of you guys were really, really good. It took me a while to get heated up and get warmed up because you guys, you guys are not bots. You know, some of these guys in this lobby here, they might be bots, but the people that I played against last night in the stream, oh no, 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 no. These guys were beasts, they were cracked. I was literally playing against some of you guys that were like on the leaderboards. You guys are like leaderboard grinders. So shout out to you guys. Thank you guys so much. And I do also want to give a huge shout out to Alpha Bravo, the main developer for the game, because he showed up. He showed up to the stream. He hung out for a little bit. He dropped us some leaks. We weren't expecting any leaks. We weren't asking for any leaks. Uh, Alpha Bravo just showed up and was like, nice stream. You know what? You guys want leaks? Gotcha. <laughs> you know what? Like, no one even asked. <laughs> Alpha Bravo just wanted to share. I think Alpha Bravo was in a very giving mood that day. I'll put the M4A1 leak that Alpha Bravo shared with us live on screen. And as you can see, it's just an image of a custom built M4A1. As you can see, it's got all sorts of attachments on it from the barrel to the, to the no stock to the magazine. It is a very short build. This is the shortest assault rifle that I have ever seen. This is a little mini AR. It looks super dope, super clean. During the stream, I assumed this was an M16 based off the iron sights, but a lot of you guys cleared it up with me. And if you zoom in on the receiver end of the gun, you can actually see that this is the M4A1. If you go to the assault rifle class in the weapon list, you will see that there are three assault rifles yet to come to the game. There is the AUG A3, which is a bullpup AR, the M4 Mark 28, and the M1 SOCOM. Um, so as you can tell, these three assault rifles are planned to be coming to the game. We just haven't received them yet. I'm sure this will be coming in upcoming updates. The leak that Alpha Bravo showed to us is essentially this gun here, the M4A1. Now the gun is already in the game, it's modeled, but the animations and I'm assuming like all the ballistics and all that have yet to be hammered out. I know from all the leaks and stuff that we've seen and especially from last night that Alpha Bravo is getting even closer to releasing the M4A1. So really cool and it's exciting because I'm starting to get the feeling that we're getting really, really close to be able to get more weapons within the game. Like I said, the AUG A3, can't wait to try that out. The M1 SOCOM, can't wait to try that out. As long with some of the other upcoming SMGs like the MP7, these weapons have been in the game for a super long time. And I'm I'm really hoping that we get some new like footage or like some leaks or like some gameplay of the new shotguns because I think these shotguns are a little underwhelming in Combat Master at the moment because there's only one. So I can't wait to get the chance to try more of these other shotguns. Like the KSG Tactical is a super cool and unique shotgun. This gun has two barrels and this gun here is just designed beautifully. This is a beautiful design for the KSG Tactical. Um, this gun exists in real life. This is a real thing. You can look it up. There's really cool videos of it on YouTube. And if, if you're into weapons, then you know what this gun is because this gun is super dope and I can't wait to get it in the game. I don't know exactly which weapons or when they will come, but I'm assuming that we will be getting some of them in the next mini update. And I'm assuming maybe in the next upcoming updates as well. They'll probably release the guns in increments, like maybe two at a time or something, until they eventually release everything. Remember, Alpha Bravo in our previous leaks video said that we would be getting a mini update, mini update, combat zone, mini update, and then finally season two. Alpha Bravo Inc. did a whole trailer for the upcoming combat zone. They had like a little countdown and everything. They showed off like some sweet little animations. But since then, we haven't really seen anything. No official images, no more teasers, no more gameplay. We've been getting the mini updates, but nothing in regards to Combat Zone, which is kind of interesting. We know Combat Zone is coming, but we don't know exactly when it's going to get here. So since we haven't gotten anything official, it's kind of nice that someone has gone ahead and leaked, or at least did some research and started to piece everything together. Because it kind of paints a better picture of what's to come for the game. So thanks to Little Grape, we got a bunch of high definition images for what's to come with Battle Royale. Oh. Anyways, 
I'll push through it. So thanks to Little Grape, we got a bunch of high definition images in regard to the new combat zone. We got a better look at the big Provost map, which is kind of like Verdansk. And besides the big Battle Royale map, unbeknownst to all of us in the combat master community we did not know that this was planned alpha bravo is also planning to release a smaller resurgent style of map similar to call of duty mobile's alcatraz island or war zones ashika slash slash rebirth island and none of us knew that this was coming there are leaks of what that map is supposed to look like it looks a little bit more tropical it's it's essentially an island with some pois like an airport um there's an ocean there's even some vehicles so i don't know if we'll be able to ride like jet skis or boats none of us knew that that was coming none of us knew that it was planned it was never leaked it was never announced so we had no idea that that stuff was planned so huge shout out to Little Grape for bringing us more information in regards to the big Battle Royale map, but also finding out that there is now a new, smaller, resurgent style of map. And I even went ahead and asked Alpha Bravo because a bunch of people were asking me, like, hey, AB, are these legit? Is this true? Is this coming to the game? And although I knew about Provost, everybody knew about Provost, nobody knew about the smaller map. So I went ahead and I asked Alpha Bravo himself and I said, hey, Alpha, all of these leaks, Standing all of these by. things that are starting to come up about Combat Masters Battle Royale, are they true? Are they accurate? You want to know what Alpha Bravo said? You want to know what the man, the developer of the game, all he said was, looks about right. That's all he said. Literally, all he said was, looks about right. So, uh, I mean, I guess all of that is confirmed. All of that is true. All he said was looks about right. So, hey, looks about right basically means, yep, right there. What happened? I'll plant this bomb, but I, I'm getting, getting a little worried here. Got him. Oh my God, the flick on that one. Holy moly. It's been really dope seeing everybody get involved with the Combat Master community. You know, people sharing information with each other and supporting each other. You know, it's been really dope, really cool to see. Um, thank you guys so much for all the love and support on this channel. Oh my God, it's it. It's over, we're done. We lost. It's over, it's over. I told you it was over. Oh my God. Come on, boys. Come on, man. Anyways. And yeah, even though I took the L in that last match, I think overall, the community is taking a dub. The community, the Combat Master community is a huge dub. And boys, we are getting closer and closer to the inevitable light at the end of the tunnel. We are starting to get more updates. We are starting to get better communication. And we're starting to see the fruition of Combat Zone. Battle Royale should be dropping hopefully by the end of this year. I don't see why it would be delayed any further, especially given the timeline that Alpha Bravo has given us. Huge shout out to the other Combat Master content creators, Charlie Vam, LB47Ghost, Cold Mobile, Goof, Lord Heck, and major shout out to Little Grape. This dude is awesome. He actually hung out with us live on stream. We got to chit chat a little bit. So shout out to my boy. Thank you so much for all the love and support on the channel. And guys, that's going to pretty much be it for this video. If you enjoyed it, then make sure to hit the like button. And if you would like to see more, then make sure to subscribe. Huge hippopotamus. I'm trying to get bigger and bigger. Huge hippopotamus sized shout out to the members. Thank you guys so much for continuing to support this channel. If you become a member, you get access to custom ABXY emojis, custom ABXY badges that show up next to your name. And you also get exclusive members only content. So there is a tab for members and you guys get a bunch of stuff just for you guys, you know, for becoming a member. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support of the channel again. Thank you for watching and have a blessed day. Stay safe, stay strong and stay healthy. Peace.